this is my first ever experience to try one of Honda's new battery uh, powered mowers. It runs a nine amp hour battery. Um, it's quite solid and to fill this battery from empty is about 77 minutes roughly. Um, you can round it out. I've never ever tried anything like this so I'm really excited because personally I've, I've been looking at self-propelled and this is a self-propelled mower. It's got an 18 inch steel deck. Um, it's mulch and catch option uh, into the catcher. So let's give it a whirl. So you just lift the top up, the battery just slides in nice and easy, really simple. Just clicks in, down it goes. And then in with the yellow button, up with the lever, the way it is, and then the self-propelled in. I like the whole self-propelled idea, especially where I live, it's not flat like it is here. Pretty good. Be nice on hills and different areas. I'm actually surprised and I guess I have been with many battery operated products in different areas I use in my tools and stuff on my adventures so um, yeah it's I, I like the whole self-propelled thing and I think that that would suit me on, on a couple of acres I do probably an hour of push mowing every time I mow and then I'm on a ride on for about two and a half hours and then whipper sipping and brush cutting so good experience the Honda battery blower. I'm excited to really test this for the first time and use it because I do probably 20 minutes of blowing a week at home. I've got some beautiful big Queensland maple trees over a concrete driveway. They make an enormous mess, but we love having them there. So um, with this in particular, it's got the flat nozzle and round nozzle. So you've got two options with it. It's really well balanced and it's super light because you carry that weight on your waist with the battery pack. I've got the big nine amp hour in there at the moment, but you can run the six and four. And the great thing is you can run the different batteries across the product range, which I, are, for me, that's what you've got to be able to do. So um, let's give it a go. It's certainly different because I'm doing it on, on gravel in this sort of area, but at home I would do it on concrete, but it's great power. And, I, and for me, compared to what I use at the moment, um, I like the weight difference. It's, it's a bit lighter because you're carrying all that weight here. So nice product. Honda's battery powered hedge cutter. Um, I always lean back to my own experiences in the yard at home. I use a hedge cutter uh, maybe once every three weeks through summer and it takes me probably 20 minutes to do it. I've got two big rows of tea trees, like a tea plantation, so I do green tea at home. Um, so it's important it does a good job. So for me, the, the weight's probably a little bit lighter, similar. This will take the four amp hour, six amp hour, and nine amp hour battery, again, across the range with the blower and the other Honda products. So let's give it a try. It's got the cover on it, which is good when you've got it stored, looks after your blades. Um, do your usual maintenance, but let's give it a turn. And the good thing with this is you can do that, but on here you just got a little lever and you can turn the handle. So if I'm going to do the side now, I've got the handle turned. And I've probably done someone out of a job here at Honda because I've just done the gardening. I like it. I would use that a lot. Honda's battery powered brush cutter. It uh, comes with a standard line head and a three bladed head as well, which is really good for cutting thicker stuff. We're gonna tackle this long grass here on this motocross jump with, with the line head. Um, really well balanced. I like the handle grip. We've got the nine amp hour battery in here. And again, across the Honda battery power range, you can run the six and the four also. So let's give it a try.
pretty good, really well balanced. Um, I think for the thicker stuff you'd use the metal head, but as strong as what I use at the moment. Good product.